Hello everyone, welcome back to Good Draw Tips and in this video I am going to talk about how to fix God of War Ragnarok is having an issue with mouse is not working or camera mouse input issue. So this is happening for many users how we can fix it. The first one is we need to start game input service and we have to close the game and go to the services and we have to find the game input service. So what we need to do is first we just need to go over here search for services and we have to open this and we have to navigate to the game input. So it is written we have to go to the game uh, first we need to close the game then we have to go to the services and find game input and we have to start the service. So just go over here and navigate to the game input service. So if you scroll down you can see the game input service right now. So you can right click over here and go for start. So it is going to start but when you, before starting you have to close the game and once the game input service is start we are fine with it. We just need to close this and we have to go back and try launch the game. If that is not the case, we have to move to the next one. That is, we have to stop and start the game input service. Before that, we have to close the game, net stop game input service and we have to start it. So this particular command that is uh, net stop game inputs SVC and net start game input in service should be given in the CMD. So let me copy this command first. First, we need to uh, stop this particular input so we just need to go over here search for cmd search for the cmd click on run as administrator go for yes first we need to paste the command now just press enter so the game input service is stopped first right now we have to go back and we have to start it to, to start it we have to copy this particular command which i'll be giving in the description so just copy this and we have to go over here and paste it once again and we have to press enter. So right now as you can see the game input service firstly it was stopped but right now it is started successfully and we are fine with it so just close this. And now what we need to do is we just need to stop first and start the game input service. So we need to go over here once again to the services we have to search for the services. We have to click on this one and right now as you can see just keep scrolling down and navigate to game input service. So right now it is running so first we have to stop it. So after the game input service is stopped, we have to wait at least for what you have to say once it is stopped, just wait for 20 seconds or hardly 13 seconds. And once afterwards, we have to go back and we have to go for a start. That is what we have to do. So once the game input service is start, we just need to close this and we have to go back and try launch the game. Next one is all about if you have to uninstall the extra game input service on your, uh, uh, if you are having on the services, so uh, just imagine this particular step is for only the users if you are having multiple game inputs game inputs so if you don't have the multiple game input you can skip this particular step so what i need to do is i just first i need to go over here search for services i have to search for the services and click on this one and right now as you can see I have to navigate to the game input so right now as you can see if i scroll down i'll be able to find the game input over here so as you can see i'm having two game input service over here as you can see the game input this is the first one and this is the second one so the one is running the other one is stopped so this is the issue so when you're having the multiple game input you have to keep one running and the other one you have to right click and go to the properties and from here you'll be able to understood that is it is on c programs file 86 microsoft game input over here you can see this particular folder so i have to copy this particular location and you have to delete it so just go over here on the uh, over here and we have to search the path just search the path and go for search it and when you search for this respective one you'll be able to find it you'll be able to find this particular that is program file x86 microsoft game input x64 game inputs over here you will be able to find it or you can close this if it's going to take time just go over here right click go to the properties and it is written c program file so first we need to navigate to c then navigate to local is c go to the program file x86 then we need to go over here then we need to find x86 go to microsoft we have to go to the microsoft just go to microsoft game input so this is the folder so what we need to do is we have to we found the path file over here so this is a very important step so we found microsoft game input so x64 game input so we have to delete this respective folder because we are having two game inputs so just delete this particular game input from here and also you can go back close this and you can go over here 
search for settings navigate to apps over here and go to the installed app and also you can search here for the game input as well you can search for the game input and if you find the game input over here you can remove the game input from here as well you can uninstall it so delete it and uninstall from here so it is not here so right now i deleted the extra one so i'm not having one but if you're having multiple one you can uninstall from here as well and also you need to delete it as well so once it is deleted it is should be deleted and once after it is deleted we have to restart the pc so just go over here go to the power icon and restart the pc and go back next one is all about after this most probably you have to try the full step that we have to use alt and tab and also you have to use alt and tab to get out of the game as well so that may be fixed so if you're on the game just press alt and tab from the keyboard then you'll be exit from the game and once afterwards you have to close it and you have to get into the game once again that is going to work for you guys as well so this is what you have to do when it comes to how to fix mouse is not working or camera mouse input is issue is on the goat of our ragnarok and we hope this video is helpful see you soon in the next video peace out bye bye